Nice! At least this is a clear mirror. So what's gonna appear behind me in the mirror? Nothing? Uh oh. Also, lazy, lazy people. It's not a real-time mirror. They haven't decided to do that. It only, like, activates a second screen. Hate to, like, geek out on you there a minute, but, like... Real-time mirrors are awesome. In some games, I understand why they're not there, like Vampire the Masquerade, for example, because, you know, there'd be no point. Ooh. Ah, uh, well. Ooh, I can do something here? Oh, I'll just turn it on and off. I can stick my fist into that. There's a beaker here, stuff. Is there anything, any purpose for my being in this room? I, there must be. Uh, I can turn the taps on and off. I can get into the cold storage, but it seems like there's no other reason to be in here, which is odd, because there must be something. Other than big old sphincter mess over here. Well, that's weird. Can I look at the computer screen? No, it's all balked. Well, I guess there's nothing I need in here. That's a lot. Another computer screen there. Nothing on. Maybe it's just for the mirror. But like, look how funky you look. I think I look pretty swag considering I'm dead. I mean, it's not every day you get to look that cool. Hey! No more crypticness? No? Just gonna randomly show up this time? Maybe they can't. Maybe they can only appear for like a few seconds at a time. They spend the next three or four years trying to dispense the most cryptic of bullshit. Only resulting with, do it, or you must, or it lives. What lives? God, I wish I knew. If only someone could tell me in some sort of fashion that wasn't complete nonsense. You should be banned from saying nonsense like that. Like immediately, like, you go, do, help us. Help us what? Just... Right, you know what I'm going to do? The first airlock I find, guess who's going out of it? It's you. You're going out of it. Ooh, another cassette tape. Please, by all means. Hey, Andrea? Hey. Yeah? I was talking to Cameron about protein solubization. Do you think we could break the aggregate and structure gel without flattening the configuration? No. Jesus. That was a mouthful. You've been listening to Cameron, that's for sure. What do you want, Raleigh? <laughs> Can you blame me for trying to figure this out? I've been having the dreams too, you know. I don't know what to believe. Oh, I know. Everything from the sudden signal amplification in black boxes to having a comatose Dr. Ross locked up in the glass jar. We've all been going a bit nuts. Tell me about it. Feels like my head's about to explode. Hypothetically speaking, could we stop the WoW from mutating? No. It doesn't work like that. Even if there was a site alpha? Hypothetically speaking, I guess we could try it. Rally, are you recording this? Sorry. I just... Sorry. So... <sighs> Rally, are you recording this? I don't know, gee, does she have a ginormous, like, 80s Walkman-style device on her? If so, probably. Bleh. Alright, I'm like the world's most grumpy scientist. There's nothing in here for me to fondle, either. I guess this is all just, uh, backstory fluff and whatnot. Huh, spooky man can't appear unless I go in there further. Power room and main entrance. What's over here, then? East stairwell. This is the way I came up, wasn't it? Probably. Yeah, it was, actually. Oh, yeah, because it was Cthulhu, man. I didn't speak Fufu language, did you? I don't buy for a rooty tooty minute that I'm here by myself, so... Let's stress this theory. This place looks 100% spookier than the place I was just in. Welcome to site Omicron. Home of evil. Enjoy your evil stay of evil. Thank you. Evil. <gasps> okay, so I gotta do another one of these puzzles. Uh, so much for me thinking that'll be the last of it. Alright, well let's look at the place I can go into. Above the main entrance. Oh wait, no, this is the main entrance. Right. Oh, and people's heads have come off again. I really wish I hadn't missed the thing, or was paying more attention to the thing that explained this. 
I can't fondle you because your head's exploded and your black box is gone, right? Damn. Although this person's head seems mostly in. Never mind. Never mind, there's definitely a hole there. Ooh, weird. Look at that. Probably see what you had for dinner. Uh. Hmm. Damn it, why the hell did their heads explode? You know what, hold on. I had a quick squint at my old video hoping I could find something, but apparently not. It's just weird. I mean, it's all in their heads. Uh, I mean, is the black box in their brain or something? Maybe something like, I don't know. Blows them up to get hold of it, or? Where am I? Upper. Uh, removing lockdown. Wait, I'm not going to do another stupid puzzle? Seriously? Neat. Oi! Cryptic man, can you not? Some of us are trying to work here. Oh, sorry, hold on, fireworks. Bloody fireworks. Stop having fun out there! Boo, hiss. Storage. Guess it'd be too simple if anything I needed would be in here. Oh my god, is that a gun? No, it's just a piece of metal! Ah! There is a nice hat, though. I miss having a skull for a friend, though. Like, didn't I have one earlier? Hmm. Well, I need a battery pack, right? What am I in the engine room? Power room? This seems like a place to have it. Oh my word, this guy is alive without his head! That's fabulous, but why are you missing- Oh, he's got a head. Never mind. Hey, chum. Oh my word. What happened to your textures? That's awful. Don't worry, I'll get whoever did this to you. I promise. Electronic hazard. Oh, right, well. That's what I need. But it isn't in there. Oh, that guy looks more with it. Man, what are the chances of that happening? Hello? This guy seems a bit dodgy. Making my vision go ape shit. Oi! Knock it off! Actually, not sure I want to get close to this one. He's laughing. Wait, I didn't think this thing. I didn't think the world was supposed to be evil. Why is this guy cackling? That's the only thing evil people do. Normal people will, like chuckle. This guy's cackling. What chances I can get to that battery pack without him going? Uh oh. Please don't attack me, that'd be great. Dick. Man, why can't I meet any friendly people? I always run into assholes. Ugh, I'm in blurry vision again. <laughs> puke everywhere. Okay, does he react to sound? Maybe? Man, what a penis. Did that work?
Well, say this is going poorly would be wrong. Okay, it doesn't react to sound at all, it seems. Clong, clong, clong. Okay. Maybe I can just carefully. Doesn't give a shit about any noises. Got it. That's good. How can I get out of here? Is the next question. Oh, he's got the claws. Wait, he's put his eyes away again. Maybe you have to move when you can't see. Oh, bollocks if I know. Whatever. Stay over there, you weird jerk. Hey, weird face man. Bye, weird face man. Okay, we've got to have an agreement here that I'll do stuff for you if you stop ruining my eyesight. Seriously, man. Alright, well this is the other way we can go. More headless people. Oh, and an anal sphincter. Nice. Yoink. What is this supposed to be called? I'm pretty sure it isn't supposed to be, like, butthole. Oh, I can see again. Ugh, remind me not to get punched. Is there anything else in here that's worth looking at? Flood hazard? What? Begs the question, why are there even windows? Okay, I need to geek out again. I do this in Dead Space all the time while they Oh, chicken tikka masala. No, noodles, shit. Okay, like... Why would you have windows? Star Trek has windows because it's transparent titanium. Right? It's really strong shit that you can see through. This looks like glass. In a sea base. Is there any any particular reason in the mess hall they need to see the water? That you can't see out of anyway because it's murky as piss. And full of weird stuff. No! It's rubbish. Stop it. Why can't I shove people? Okay. Let me listen. Johan Ross was found dead on the climber this morning. The ARC team went down a couple of days ago, but I see no reason to suspect them playing a part in his death. The climber can't be operated from the abyss, so there was a scheduled retrieval. The climber returned with only the lifeless body of Alpha member Johan Ross. No traces of the ARC team. Well, there was a the trace. Eames, Lansky, all studying the body inside containment. I'll follow up with whatever they find. Delenda Est. The WoW has been getting more aggressive, pushing all systems to their limits. Ironically, the dead Dr. Johan Ross would be the perfect person to ask why the WoW is making such a big buzz about his passing. After all, the WoW isn't supposed to want anything. And definitely not to mourn people. The system overload affects the staff considerably. Headaches, loss of sleep, unwarranted stress. And it seems to be getting worse. I could use some advice if you can get through. Delenda Est. Maybe that's why their heads exploded. Something to do with the wow. Things are out of hand. The staff looks like they're about to explode. Every other person walks around with nosebleeds. And the rest keep wiping stains of blood from their eyes to keep them from overflowing. That's to do with the wow trying to free Ross somehow for sure. At this point I wouldn't be surprised if the body just got up and left. Rally Herber, our dispatcher, has been snooping around asking questions she shouldn't. She says she's going down into the abyss to find Alpha. I can't bring myself to stop her. Uh, alright. Weird. Maybe her head exploded when she was writing this. Awkward.
Well, not a lot to say about that. I think that answers the questions pretty nicely, truthfully. Uh, which way am I going? This way. Downstairs. I'm surprised the monster didn't follow me. Oh, well. I mean, yeah, that explains why their heads are going bang then. I guess it's like to do the wow. So, I guess I just had. I didn't have the answer. I just had to wait for like five minutes before I started whinging that I didn't know what the answer was. Her. Cryptic man. Oh, cryptic man. I need to go downstairs, don't I, cryptic man? East stairwell, downwards. This is where I came in, wasn't it? Is there a door here? That is now open. Oh yeah, here we go. Override, please. Just the one door. Well, seems perfect for next time then. The South Hall for the last part I need. Then we can presumably get the hell out of here and go into the Abyss, which sounds like a fabulous idea, I might add. Anything called the Abyss, even the Abyssal Layer of the Sea, is usually a bad idea, right? I don't know, just it seems like it's unwise. Oh well, what's the worst thing that could happen? Dead people is the worst thing that could happen. Uh, on that note, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the set, and until next time.